This video is for all those people who bought a brand new T2i and have created a beautiful video and now they want to decide how to render it um, with good compression and good quality. This is my method using Sony Vegas and H.264. First you edit your video. Before you edit your video actually you want to set your project settings to, ma to match your source file. So you go down to properties you make sure that uh, the settings in here match your uh, source file. So you want this to say 1920 by 1080 if you recorded at that. 23.976 frames per second which is what I record at. Progressive scan 1 1.0 for pixel aspect ratio uh, best for rendering quality uh, and for deinterlace method none. Okay click apply, click OK. Okay, now we're good to go. Edit your video as you see fit. Go to File, go to Render As. Now, a lot of people prefer Sony uh, main concept. I think, frankly, I think the Sony AVC looks better than main concept. I've looked at, I've tested using both. Um, also, if you have Sony Vegas Platinum, you have no options to uh, customize main concept. So you're going to want to use Sony ABC. Click Sony ABC. Click custom. Make sure this says 1920 by 1080 in here. If it doesn't, click custom frame size and type it in yourself. Okay. For this one, you want it to say C-A-V-L-C. Why? I don't know. That's just what I use, and somebody who knows a lot more than me told me to use that, so I do. Uh, frame rate, 23.976 to match my source file. Uh, it's progressive video, so I make sure this says none. And then I choose a high bit rate of 10 million. Uh, that's kind of overkill. Uh, 4 million should be sufficient for most people. Uh, but I like the best quality I can get, and I have big hard drives, so it doesn't really matter for me. But you can play around with that and see what setting is best for you. Um, audio I leave the same, system I leave the same, project I leave the same. Click OK. Title the video which you want it to be titled. Decide where you want to place it. Click Save and you're good to go. Uh, that's my method for rendering video from the T2i with Sony Vegas. Um, it's you'll see a few differences in Sony Vegas Platinum but the concept is the same so hopefully this will be helpful to somebody out there